What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Plants vs. Zombies 3 and 20 new levels have been added. I don't know how many I'll get to today, uh, but I can also uh, cash in on this start a new day thing really quick so that we do indeed start a new day in the new area. Everyone get down on the ground. We've got an incoming space, <laughs> alien spacecraft. Zombies and aliens? Nate's grand adventure is going to get even grander than anticipated. That's not an alien spaceship dummy. It's just a flying fog vacuum me and Uncle Dave built. I knew that, obviously. I was testing you. Come on, let's race across the field. I'll give you a head start. <laughs> Hold up, Nate. Zombie alert. Zombie buggins no good zone? Huh? I don't know what they're up to, Uncle Dave. Let's sneak around the, uh, the end zone and get a better look. So we'll do that. I need one more ticket to do so. So let's start a level. Thankfully, we've got the three-peter thing going on. So this could be really good for us. Uh, let's jump into it. This looks like a traditional level. I do have to worry a little bit because I, I tend to have problems with the lightning read. Uh, but I don't know why. Uh, so yeah, ready, set, plan. Let's start it up real nice and good. I think I'm going to put these here. And I don't know what we got to worry about at Begonia Boulevard right now, but probably not much. Probably not much. This might just be a get me, get me, ease me back into things. Let my three Peter grow ahead. And then uh, move on. Are coming. Uh, let's see. Yeah, yeah, I see you. I see you. I'll, I'll deal with you in a second. We'll have to just drop this one down here to start us off. And then we'll try, I'll try to get a uh, sunflower in again. Another one. I should have probably put it. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I should have put that, that next sunflower down one. But. I think we'll be able to get out a uh, another cabbage pulp. There we go. We got three waves, so I, I ideally want to get more sun in here than just one column. But it might just depend on how many uh, cabbage pulps we can get out here in time to, to determine if we go ahead with the, uh, yeah, I think we're safe. I think we're good right now. Um, in fact, I want to slip in a lightning. And then uh, I'm anticipating more cabbage bolts going forward. Uh, especially up right there we go. And then um, I think I'm building fast enough. I, I don't really know. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that down for now. I think we're in a good spot, relatively speaking, but... I'm gonna go ahead and put that one down there. I'm gonna try to get another lightning reed in here and put it right here to help take care of the conehead and these two clowns. There you go. And then bottom row, probably lightning would do good. Top row lightning would also be great in a second, as soon as we can. I'm gonna probably put this here, get him stuck there. Top row lightning could be, actually I wanna do this. I wanna get three points for both of those. We might have a gargantuar, I don't know. And if we do have a Gargantuar, well, we either let Mo take care of it, or we just get him a squash. Really delay things. It just depends. We'll see what, I, I think we have more than enough right now to take care of this stage. Let's begin fast forwarding. And, I'm a, I'm a little concerned. But again, I think we're okay. It's kind of hard to tell. Sometimes they start falling apart pretty quickly once they get past that two. Top row looks a little dire, so let me just go there really quick. Eh, okay. Yeah, maybe I, maybe I didn't play as, as smart as I could have. I'm not preserving a lot of my sun. Which is okay, I have enough sun right now. Some of that was so close. 
like I barely got it. Was this the final wave? Okay, I, I think I did that pretty darn good then. Uh, good job to me and to the level for being a good level, I guess. Well, that's cool. I haven't seen that before. And I qualify for the Crash Course event, heck yeah. Let's continue day nine then. Let's claim our lunch. And then let's uh, continue onwards. Uh, do it. All right, fellas, it's sneaky sneaking time. Ah, Fooey, sneaking around is no fun. We should just run over there and smash him and give away the element of surprise. I'd love to smash him too, but we'd better play it smart. All right, there they go. Blast, another miserable failure. That attempt was even worse than before. Why is this so difficult? Tugboat? Enough excuses, Tugboat. If you can't get these cretins to vote for me on election day, I'll find a campaign manager who can. What have those creeps done to our school field? Look at all those signs. What the heck is going on over here? We'll find out by spying on the zombies and training, but we got a couple more levels to blast through. The bamboo will help. That's a cool, I mean, I like this artwork that they're throwing at us right here. Oh no, a st oh, this is new. A stealth imp has infiltrated the lawn. Huh, okay. What does that mean for us? I don't like him. We only got one wave. Plants won't attack stealth imp while sneaking. So you gotta make him stop sneaking. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. Stop sneaking, you stealth guy. There he is, he has to come out of stealth to get the walnut. Okay, I gotcha. Force stealth imp out of hiding by making it attack. Right, but we have one wave, so this should be good. This looks like a safe place for it. We got a rake trap as well. So w here's the question, will the rake hit the stealth imp? I'm gonna guess it will, but we'll see. We only have one wave, I'm not super duper worried, but I do wanna get the sun out here really quick. And keep in mind, we're gonna need a lot more uh, of these type of things, so let me just drop those out. I'm gonna try to get my walnuts and my sun production out here as soon as possible. And uh, let's see, we also are gonna need peas. Now we could also probably take out the stealth imp with the squash, keep that in mind. The main thing is I just don't know. This is only one wave. I'm just trying to figure out where we're gonna plant stuff. All right, I'll drop one of them down there. It's almost like two waves. It's like one wave and then like another rush at the end. So it's almost like two in a way, but it looks like one. I don't know how to actually say it. All right, let's just, we're gonna get this. I think this is gonna be just fine, final wave. So yeah, technically two waves when you look at that. Um, are there any more stealth imps is the main question I have. There's one at the bottom, he'll get revealed soon. We'll pop three points out of him, same with the middle. Not super worried about it. There you go, and imps are, you know, weak. Hey, and well, not quite. Hold on, let me get. Uh, I was gonna try to go for symmetry. But hey! Cool stage introducing a new type of zombie. Always fun. Gotta love those new load screens. Uh, let's go with the next level then. This is looking good. No new plants at the moment, I don't think. Maybe they'll show showcase one soon. I heard there's a new plan. Uh, I love the extra starting sun. That is super useful for me. This is a completely flat Begonia Boulevard. Look at that, so flat. I'm just waiting for things to start up. I kind of wish, uh, well, I don't know. The way it's designed now, it lets you pick where you put your sunflowers, but there's always like a, like a, it's almost like a one minute build up to each level where it's like, I'm not really doing much other than planting sun. 
kind of lulls me to a false sense of security, right? <laughs> All right. Uh, prepare for the cabbage, Pulse. We got several waves here. It's like three additional waves. We got to worry about wherever the stealth imp is going to show up. That probably means I should just go ahead and start planting these. But I'm sure Stealth Imp will also respond well to the, uh... To, uh... Bonk Choy. Literally don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm just planting all over the place. There's the Stealth Imp! Oh boy, I use all my sun. Oh well, we're okay for the moment. Uh, well, I'm not super happy about her breaking through that, but that's okay. Alright, this guy over here is breaking through as well. We might have... I don't have anything attacking right there, whoops. Hold up. If I could get a little bit more, uh, they're gonna break through, aren't they? Let's just pause them again. There you go. I might have put that a little too close, honestly, but again, I don't think we're gonna miss out this is going to go pretty well, I imagine. Oh, there he goes. He shows up, and then boom. Bonk Choi gets him quick. Lickety split. Uh, this row is struggling big time. If I could just... Put an end to them really quick. That would be nice. Oh, jeez. I don't like this at all. Oh, that, that the grape shot actually got him. There you go. Can't complain about this lineup, can you? I guess you could if you wanted to be a whiner. Now let's just start putting them out. Who, who cares? Oh wow, I kind of care. Hold on. I care a little bit because look at, look at what's happening here. This is a, it's a lot. And he ate that. Darn. She. Him a treat. Three stages complete. We're looking good here. All right. Time to eat lunch again. Love it. Love it. Those guys look so cool. Up next, a hard level, but we have our three Peter in full bloom. Let's go for it. See what happens here. Another uh, Begonia Boulevard level without variation in the terrain. We do have lightning. We get that. Okay, so that's interesting. We will. Oh, we have that too. What? What kind? Of, I wish it announced. It, I wish it let us know which zombies we're facing against. Like like other Plants vs Zombies games, it doesn't like let you know what we're you're, you're up against, and that's kind of frustrating for me personally. I think I'm just gonna do lightning read last and really focus on. I mean, this is another stage where we have like three additional waves, so let's just see where this goes. I don't know if we should expect stealth imp in this. I mean, we we just don't know what they're gonna have. That's the that's the overall my overall complaint about. Uh, it's not my overall complaint, but it's it's one complaint I have <laughs> about this about the way that this is set up, so. There's that stealth imp. I guess we could put this guy here. Oh, I thought he was gonna, oh man. Okay, well, all right. There he is. But now we have to somehow, oh, well, let's just, oh, please stay, stay, stay exposed. Thank you. Oh, great. This is not wonderful for me. Mostly because I thought, all right. Uh, down there. We're gonna, it's gonna take a lot of effort to, oh, we, we got him, but she's still on the prowl. Huh. How about right there? 
Oh, great. How am I going to stop this? You know what? Just unleash this really quick. It's a lot to deal with. Those, those also target the stealth imp, so that's useful. So the, uh, the stealth imp can be targeted in a way by... Uh, Try to get. Uh, it can be targeted by the by the gumball machine, so that's good. I think I'm gonna put that down there. That that will block. Oh jeez, will the, will the, okay, hold on, this is not good, this is a lot of stuff coming out here at once. What the heck? Uh, not thrilled about what's going on. Got some of the worst ones out of the way though. Two bucket heads in the middle. Thank you, Grapes of Wrath. Alright, how are we going to handle this? Let's throw out more lightning if we can. Oh, we got that Gargantuar. Well, the Gargantuar, we're going to try to take out. That was a good hit. Probably. Probably not. Now, does the lightning only hit the, them when they're exposed? Yeah, the lightning only hits them when exposed. That's annoying. But he's going to expose himself right there. Um, I, w I would like to dig this up and put in more lightning here to also attack the Gargantuar. And in theory, also right here. But I think the Squash will do a good job with him at this point. There he goes. He goes goodbye. All right, excellent. Hmm. Do we have the tickets now? We do. Do it. One more time from the top. If this run doesn't go perfectly to plan, I'll expect your resignation on my desk by the end of the day. Tugboat. Tugboat, tugboat, tugboat. Ba, 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 ba. We get it. What's he doing? What's he doing? Excellent, excellent. Now all he has to do is check the box next to my name. It's the only one on the paper. Dang, no signs of any human resistance. Just whatever this is. I thought you said this election was next week. They're practicing. Zomboss is using our school as some kind of zombie voter brainwashing center. He's subverting democracy, Uncle Dave. Not on my watch. Time to call in a squabba mabba bubble strategic airstrike. Only need four tickets for that airstrike, huh? Well, let's go in and see what we got. Uh, Plantern's back. That must mean we have fog to deal with. Plantern can also reveal sneaking zombies like this. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that, but now I know. Not that I get a choice of when I bring in the Plantern, but it's cool, cool to know. Boom. Plantern has more use. All right, so uh, with that said, I mean, I don't know if I want him that far back, but maybe. Uh, let's just focus on getting these things out here really quick. I'll probably keep a couple of plantains in the front just to say I have it, you know. I do want one of these up here, just because of the gumball machine. I don't want the gumball machine triggered too early. Boom! Try not to click that. Uh, I think this is enough sunflower right now. I'll, I'll go put in one more. I'd like to get another walnut in there. I would also like to get just whatever I can get, really, out here so I can 
be prepared. I know that the... I know that if, you, if you're looking at it from the perspective of, do I have enough sun? I think I do. I think I, I think I have plenty of sun. I'm just worried that they're gonna like rush me with a bunch of stuff at the end that I'm not gonna be prepared for. But I should be prepared. I have all these planters out anticipating like a horde of stealth imps. And I feel like I'm doing pretty good with this. Um, I don't know what the bonk choice exactly are gonna be used for, simply because. Oh, see, they're revealed though. That's good. I could, I could see me putting this here. It should get me a three. And now what? That guy will be revealed soon enough, I'm sure. I guess just put this one here. Although, I actually, I probably didn't need to put that one there. Oh well. Final wave, this would be a great time to launch the gumball. I think once everything gets closer to the three-pointer mark, that's what I'll do. I don't know about the bonk choice. I don't know if I really need him right now. Oh, grapes are rash right now. And then the gumball machine coming through. And then this guy's here. Boom, 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 boom. Off with your head. That's that's good. It will keep going. Was that a hard? I don't think that was a hard one even. We'll see how it goes. Up next is another normal one. So I'm happy about that. We'll do our best, I'm sure. There you go. Again, with the, the planting situation here, I mean, I'm just doing what I can do, you know what I'm saying? I'm, a, I'm so afraid of all the imps that are gonna be coming out here. They got me terrified, petrified, mortified, or none of the above. Uh, let's just start dropping. I, I doubt I can beat whatever's gonna come out here first, but Does it stall the imp like a little bit when he comes out and like takes his you know, you know becomes visible again? Right. There's several waves on this one. I might put in another column. Sure, go ahead, and, go ahead and launch one out. Boom! Alright, so here's something. This imp is gonna get hit by this guy. There you go. Got a couple imps coming through. Uh, this one should be revealed soon. A bigger concern, though, is there's nothing on the bottom row, so I don't know. Rats. Great, that one didn't. Okay, so that one disappeared afterwards. So it does stall him a little bit to come become visible again. Oh no! Oh no! Here, let's let's. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? I'm so worried. He's just gonna, there we go. Got him. Good. Uh, that was remarkable in the sense that I was not anticipating that happening exactly like that. Going back invisible afterwards. You know, I would think if you were if you were shooting at someone and they're standing in a row, and then you saw them go invisible, you would just keep shooting, right? You'd just be like, oh, well, I'm not going to stop shooting just because he showed his face and then became invisible again. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep on shooting because I'm going to assume he's there, but these plants... I don't know. I'm trying to hold on to my gumball machine for as long as possible because I still don't know what they're going to throw out at us. So plus, we have the Grapes of Wrath, which I always forgot to forget about. So, 
I didn't know that. I didn't remember that at all, but... Oh, no. Here's the problem. I didn't know they had eaten through already. It's a miraculous that I haven't accidentally clicked the gumball machine yet. Uh, let me get one more of these guys out. What in the world? I would think gumball machine is a good time for one. Look at that. They were just right there. I got a bunch of three-pointers there, too. I guess we're about done. That was another good round. If that was it, that was a good round. All right, gumball machine definitely helped me, though. I don't know how well I would have got through without it. But it was definitely, it definitely assisted me. Up next is a hard stage. I don't feel too much pressure, though. But we're going in. And uh, the hard stage is... Okay. Doesn't look too bad on the lineup. If it's hard with lightning, I get a little worried. But there is a fog attack, so I definitely see the need for the planter other than just imp detection, so... There we go. And, you know, I could also see the value of putting, like, this here as well. Just so that, you know, the planter doesn't get eaten. And so we're largely focusing on that over anything else, but gumball machine, I would like to slow down uh, in front of the gumball machine with the... Ice P, there's several waves again, so it's just another situation where it just feels like I'm gonna need more sun than what they're allotting me. I'm not, I don't have anything to shoot here. There you go. Bottom row needs it too, though. ASAP, please. Uh, come on. I'm just gonna put that there. I don't. I'm not ready. I need the bunk choy like soon. Wow. Okay. Hold on. 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 This is getting out of hand. Uh. Well. You know what? Fine. Thank you. That definitely helped. Uh. But now what? I'm gonna start putting out the bunk choice, I think. I'm not sure where they're gonna go. I don't even know if I can reach them. There you go. Or four. Uh oh. Well, there goes that, but if I could get another, uh, oh, the top row is looking terrible. Probably my fault, unfortunately. Uh, again, not my favorite thing happening right now. That's not good. That, that bug is going to get eaten. Okay, I'm not having a great time right now. This is, uh... 
I think we're not going to make it if I don't adjust quickly. The top row is, should be taken care of in theory. If I can just keep a uh, nut on it. Uh, is that bog between the second row holding out? I hope so. Seems to be. One more bonk toy, but I think Mo will take care of him at this point if we need him to. Oh, we're just now getting into the M territory. Oh boy, I don't know, man. You know. Oh, we got him. I thought maybe we were gonna lose him there. Lose to him. All right. Excellent work. So this, this this update really is, at least for these levels, all about the stealth imp. Um, hmm. There's water here. Do you think we'll have stealth imp in the water? I just don't know what to think right now. I could save the rake. If I put that there. Uh, let's see. I don't have any other squash. In my repertoire. In my inventory. In my arsenal. In... All right, we got three waves here. I know it's kind of like a hodgepodge of things, but. Uh, well, I don't think I can stop her. I think she's gonna hit with the rake again, but am I might be able to stop I'm stopping her, don't worry. I was wrong. Top row's looking crazy. All right, I, I mean, I might have to give up on that bottom row eventually. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to give up. I knew she was gonna trigger it very soon. Uh, we might have to just like let, let that squash get it then, I don't know. It's not a lot I can do at the moment with this. There goes the squash. Unfortunate. Oh no! What the heck? Sorry, I just now saw that. What the heck? I don't feel like this stage is going to be hard, but then again, here we are. Oh, how did I miss it? I meant to put it at the top, but that's okay. Alrighty. Let's blast him. Seeing the need for for some of these uh, walnuts as a deterrent for these imps. Oh, good. I don't know where they're going to show up again, but. Still got another wave coming through. Here's my question. Will this take care of the, the stealth imp? It will. Good. Uh, I don't really see any other stealth imps. We're going to want to unleash uh, very soon the... I 
guess we want to get as many three points as we can, so we let them progress a little bit more. There you go, a few more threes. And a two to go along with that. The lawn has been cleared again. Continue onwards. Let's see. I guess it's very... Oh, well, we can cash in on this now. Squash the voting booth. What's taking that little run so long? There's only one name on the ballot. Squash. Whoa. Good job, Squash. Tugboat, I heard a squashing sound. What's going on down there? Hey, a little Eddie Z, is that you? It's me, Dave. Sorry about that little boom bipple satellite malfunction earlier. <laughs> Curse you, Crazy Dave. Your constant interference has gone on too long, and it's Dr. Zomboss to you. Tell you what, Ed, if you got any human prisoners in there, just let them go and we'll take it easy on you. Prisoners? Let them go? I think I'd rather ship their juicy brains off to my Pop Smarts factory. No deal. Fine, have it your way. We're going to tear you down one miserable piece at a time, starting with all those hideous signs. All right, I guess next will be to turn, tear down the signs. A very hard stage has got me very worried, especially because of all the lightning required. I think I'm going to bring in a little, a couple extras. Let's just go all out. I think we're, I think going all out would be, would be very good. Oh, okay. Well, let's see what we got. It's even more than ever before, so let's just be happy about it. Let's put these here. Uh, let's continue with this. Uh, pretty sure that's where they're going, right? You're coming. All right, we've been spending a lot. I am worried. Because I don't think the lightning will, will get them unless... Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That's good news. Um... Alright, everything should be relatively covered for the moment. Now, with that said, you know... Obviously, we're going to need to do a little more. Sure. I know it's a little early. I know I need more lightning. I think he's going to trigger that, unfortunately. That's so sad. But, hit a lot of them in the back, so that's good news. I'm just going to do my best and try to put all this lightning. I think we need more lightning sooner rather than later. Lightning there we go, right? Feeling pretty good about it, maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Got her, good. That bottom row imp should be gone in my opinion. Yeah, here we are. Oh, they ate, they ate through that. How is that even possible? Oh, no. This is terrible. What the heck? We're already experiencing this. Well, she triggered that. That's cool by me. Um, sort of. It's not my favorite. Darn it. Did you really eat that imp? Uh, what is gonna happen? Okay, Grapes of Wrath. Good, good. Blow him up. I mean, he's like the only one there. Really? All of that for what? For nothing? Are you kidding me right now? Come on. Reveal the imp. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Hit, hit him. Hit him. Thank you. Why is the Gargantuar still alive? 
What in the world? Alright, they can see those imps again. I This is actually really tough. I was smart to bring in all the extra power-ups. Holy cow. This is not my favorite at all. You know what? Fine. Oh, jeez. What a mess. What a big mess. That was hard. That was too hard. Too hard, but whatever. We did it. Thanks to the power-ups that I, not only I was awarded through the three-peter, but that I also brought in. Very cool. Very cool. Ooh, a new plant to showcase. Well, guess what? We're going to do that tomorrow. We'll dip into 320 and do all the rest of the stages tomorrow. Uh, that way, you know, I can use the thumbnail for the imp for this episode, the thumbnail for the new thing, the lychee or whatever next episode. I'll see you for that. Goodbye and thanks for watching. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.